A shooting happened at night at Gazelle Meadows Park near Arizona Avenue in Chandler Boulevard. ABC 15's Listelia Caballero has reaction from his family and what they are demanding following this decision. While Anthony Cano is no longer here, his family wants to make sure this doesn't happen to another child again, calling on the county to hold officers accountable. He was just a kid. He was just a kid. <laughs> Anthony Cano's cousin Marcus and his aunt Eva disappointed with the decision. It's already a wound and it's just cutting deeper. The shooting happened after police say 17-year-old Anthony Cano failed to stop when officer Chase Beback Miller flagged him for riding a bicycle without a front headlight. Didn't he get a chance yeah. to beat somebody. He didn't get a chance to go home. Body camera footage shows Cano had a gun as he ran away, but he never turned toward the officer chasing him. When the teen was shot the first time in the back, he was tossing the gun. When the second shot was fired, the teen was face down and the weapon was more than 10 yards away. The first one paralyzed him. The second one killed him. That second shot is hard to watch, um, but based on his explanation of it, that he thought that he was still in imminent danger, uh, that was that is the crux of the decision. Weapon drawn! Get on the ground! County Attorney Mitchell says by law, they must look at the situation in real time and not make decisions based on slow down videos or what could have been done. And while the county chose not to charge Officer Beback Miller, Greg Kirkendall, Cano's mother's attorney, would have. If the officer were treated like the rest of us, uh, it would be a clear uh, decision for the county attorney to charge him with homicide. It's just disheartening to think that that's, that that's where we are. County Attorney Mitchell says she's aware she inherited a backlog of officer-involved shooting reviews and says it's a priority for her to get through them. Reporting in Phoenix, Lustelia Caballero, ABC 15, Arizona. Lustelia, thank you. And that officer had been involved in a shooting at the very same park eight months earlier. The city of Chandler also paid out more than a million dollars to Cano's family.